Hi guys, so I've managed to get some work done on these this week. Uh, this is the um, Contempt Talon made out of the Kalf Contempt Dreadnoughts. Um, I have done a bit of alterations on them. Um, altered the legs slightly, altered the posing on the arm. This one has actually had a, a head swap for a spare Contempt head that I had sitting around. Um, I did blast these up a bit with the uh, the airbrush before I painted them as well. Put a bit of silver on the um, the torso and the arms just to kind of break it up from the standard of my um, other Contemptor Dreadnoughts. So as you can see, I went for a similar scheme, um, apart from having the, the silver on the, the body. Um, this is the first Contemptor out of the Talon. Went for a big transfer over the arm. Um, you'll have seen these in the um, adding transfers video that I did. Um, legs, I've just gone... The, the legs are the, probably the worst part of the calf. Dreadnoughts, there's not much way you can pose them, um, apart from, as I found, chopping in between the joints there. As you can see, yeah, chopping in between those bits, and it gives you a little bit of posing you can do with them. So that's the first one. Second one, I went for a slightly different pose, more of a leaning forward shooting kind of pose. So uh, there we go, I'll give that a quick once around so you can see what I've done with this. It is a, a really quick scheme. Just to get them painted up, they have come out quite nice. I do like them, and um, I think the silver just makes them look that little bit different to the um, the other dreadnoughts that I've done. And this one I've done for a, I've gone for a kind of a, like a stride and forward, reaching for something with its claw. Um, I have given them all the the carries assault cannon because it is the um, the go to weapon with contemptors for me. It's it's it does so well in games. Um, the multi melter is nice, but with a lot of the um, the targets for the dreadnoughts actually having the armored ceramite, it doesn't really do a lot for them. So I have gone for the carries, as I said. Uh, so yeah, this one striding forward pose, as I said, chopped between the legs, chopped in the torsos, um, just to give it like slightly different pose. Also chopped off the arm joints here, so I could move them around slightly. And it, it does work, it makes them look more lively rather than standing in the, the, the one pose. But the legs, um, it's just going to be too much work to actually trim round the knees and everything. So I just left them as they were and kind of like just put them into a more lively pose. So there we go, that is the Calth Contemptor Talon. Hope you like them and we shall catch you in a later video. Bye bye for now.